we discussed that uh, parameters are always unknown and those can be estimated by statistics parameters are nothing but statistical constants of population so uh, parameters are estimated by uh, corresponding statistics <coughs> among all the estimators of uh, parameter uh, among all the estimators of the parameter we should choose the good estimator so when do you call an estimator as good estimator let us suppose that is what do you call mu as mu as population mean population mean means clearly unknown value so whenever it is unknown value we estimate that by corresponding statistic so mu may be mean may be estimated by sample mean may be estimated by sample median or mode whatever may be the characteristics char uh, uh, statistic but that should be a good estimator means whenever we have a population uh, constant say parameter it is to be estimated as population parameters are unknown to us to estimate the parameters we should use the statistics maybe one may use sample mean or be sample median or sample mode but uh, they should among all those one we should choose the good estimator so when do you call an estimator as a good estimator means there is a criteria for an estimator to be a good estimator it should be an unbiased ness criteria is it should be an unbiased estimator it should be a consistent estimator it should be an efficient estimator and it should be an sufficient estimator no so when do you call it estimator as a uh, good estimator is nothing but whenever it satisfies all these four conditions we call that as an un uh, good estimator so it should be unbiased it should be consistent it should be efficient and should be efficient sufficient so let us start with unbiasedness unbiased estimator unbiased estimator so uh, the definition is nothing but let theta be the parameter let us consider theta, this as parameter and tn be the estimator for theta as uh, we know that parameters are always unknown theta is a parameter so Let uh, let us say that T n is one of the estimator for theta. When we call this as an unbiased estimator, is if the expected value of estimator is equal to theta. Means if if at all expectation of T n is equal to theta, we call that as unbiased estimator. if e of tn is not equal to theta we call that as biased estimator okay when do you call an estimator as unbiased means whenever the expected value of the estimator is equal to the true value of the parameter that is expectation of tn is equal to theta we call that as unbiased estimator so let us do uh, some of the simple here going to do some problems on this on uh, 7 to 8 problems let us start from first one the question is show that x bar is unbiased estimator of parameter lambda for the sample of size n drawn from poisson distribution the question is show that x bar is unbiased estimator of lambda for a parameter for a sample of size n drawn from poisson distribution the question will be given in this way x bar so x bar is you need to show that x bar is unbiased estimator for parameter lambda from which population it is drawn from a population poisson so for all this is the first question i am uh, really very concentratedly listen because the remaining questions 
will be in the same pattern. First try to identify the sample uh, from which population the sample is drawn. Here the sample is drawn, let us always we write the sample with x1, x2, so on xn is a sample from which population here? Poisson distribution or Poisson distribution or Poisson population. I think you have studied in second semester. We write that with x follows p lambda. Here you should recall the mean and mean and variance of all the distributions like binomial, Poisson, normal, and exponential. These four distributions you should remember mean and variance. So we write that x follows p lambda. We write mean expectation of what is the mean of Poisson distribution? We call this as the parameter lambda. What is the variance of uh, Poisson distribution? This is also lambda. Okay. Now what is the question here? It is a sample drawn from Poisson distribution. You need to show that x bar is unbiased estimator of lambda. So what is x bar? x bar stands for sample mean. What is the sample size here? It is of size n. So how do you define x bar as sum of the observations by number of observations which is nothing but uh, uh, x bar is equal to 1 by n sigma xi. When do you call an estimator as unbiased estimator? If expectation of estimator is equal to parameter we call that as unbiased estimator. So here that is you need to prove that expectation x bar is unbiased estimator. So you should write, you should show that you have to show that e of x bar is equal to lambda. If you can show that e of x bar is equal to lambda, that is expected value of estimator is equal to parameter, then this will be the unbiased estimator of lambda. E of x bar. What is the formula for E of x bar here? 1 by n sigma xi. So did you remember expectation results here this is a constant it is a variable expectation of a constant is constant so it can be taken out of the expectation 1 by n sigma expectation of xi okay which is nothing but 1 by n sigma what is mean of uh, expectation of x is nothing but mean what is the mean of poisson distribution lambda here this is independent of phi you will get n lambda by n which is equal to lambda. So we got expectation of x bar is equal to lambda. Therefore we say we can say that x bar sample mean is unbiased estimator of population mean. Okay. Thank you.